My name is Kate McCarthy. I'm a senior program officer here at the Vermont Community Foundation, and I work on our grants and community impact team. One of the impact areas that I get to work on is called economic equity. It's one of five focus areas for grant making that we have for the next five years. And economic equity really is about building financial security for individuals and families. And so in that way, it really builds on the work we've done over the past several years to close the opportunity gap. It integrates a lot of what we've learned from COVID response and recovery, and it speaks to kind of the situation where we find ourselves today in Vermont and, and nationally. So it's about building financial security. The equity piece is very much about thinking about how we can provide opportunities to folks who have been left behind over time, whether that's because they're um, low-income folks who've had less access to opportunities like homeownership, or whether it's groups that have experienced um, gender or racial discrimination when they've tried to open a business or buy a house. So within the economic equity, under the economic equity umbrella, there are a few areas of grant making that, that I'm looking at. Um, one has to do with home ownership. Um, it is just such an important topic in Vermont right now and nationally that we really, we really need to create more homes for folks in more locations. We need a range of housing types to accommodate the different household sizes and the aging population. Um, and we need that in order to strengthen individuals and families. We also know that it's absolutely essential to have housing um, so that people who want to take jobs in Vermont can do that. Uh, so it's really a type of investment that supports, um, that supports the people who live here, the people who might live here, and the, the businesses who want to be here. So housing is one piece. Another piece that we're looking at is business ownership and entrepreneurship. And this, um, this is a focus area of VCF for a while, but also comes out of COVID recovery, where we learned that places that have a higher rate of entrepreneurship are actually more resilient to economic shocks. And so when we look at those, um, those businesses or those seeds of ideas that people have all across the state and think about ways that we can support those in coming to fruition and growing, um, we strengthen and diversify our economy in, in ways that I think are really important. And then connected to all of that is this place that we call home um, as an essential piece of our economic development. When we can strengthen downtowns and villages, when we can support businesses that really build on the assets we have, uh, like our environment, our communities, our creativity, um, I think that we can go really far. And so that's how we're approaching economic equity. There are so many strong partners working on this and so much good work that's been done that I think we have a lot of really exciting opportunities to build on. I'm looking forward to doing it.